What you guys got another video here for you. In this one we're going to be taking a look at how we can back up our registry and restore our registry and also we're going to be looking in another video um, after this one is part two of the video which is how to restore your registry if the system doesn't boot and we're going to be using tweaking.com windows repair tool for that okay. Now tweaking.com's uh, windows repair tool is a free tool and uh, as you can see here we're going to be using the portable version now you don't have to leave this onto your desktop you can put it into another location like your C root directory if you wish um, but we're going to be running it from our desktop now once we've fired this up as you can see we are running a Windows 8 machine 32 bit tells you right up here now this does uh, this backing up uh, procedure works with Windows Vista Windows 7 Windows 8 and uh, you can back up your registry by using this tab here uh, step 5 backup okay now this does give you some options to back up the registry and create a restore point and also you can um, use justcloud.com but we're just going to be concentrating on the registry part for today's video so basically what we're going to do here is click on backup and as you can see it quickly backed up the registry and then it disappeared now where did that go so what that's done is made a backup of our registry and uh, put it into our C root directory so let me just go down there and have a look so as you can see here there's a folder in here called reg backup this is a folder it's created and there you can see there's the bench computer and there's a ton of folders in here the reason why there's a lot of folders in here is because every time you back up it will create a new folder and it will give you the uh, date and time of when you created that so there's the date the latest one is the 15th of the 7th 2014 1814.31 that's the last one we created inside there will be all your information you can see here dos restore that will be in another video we'll cover that when the system is not booting okay and you can still restore your registry to get it back up and running again so let's have a look in the c drive here you can see we've got users and windows in here and we're not going to go too far into that but that's basically your registry backup okay so let's restore our backup assuming that you can still get to your desktop and your registry is playing up and you've got a few issues well you can hit the restore tab here and what that's going to do is open up the actual uh, program now you can see we're in the backup tab here we need to click on the uh, restore registry tab and uh, once you get in here you'll see a box here okay with a little drop down box you can select which version of registry you want to roll back to okay now assuming this is the one you want to do so we're going to click on this this is the very latest one you can look at the actual dates and the actual time so the very top one is the latest one because it was 18 uh, 14 and 31 seconds so you can see there well, that's the one we're going to click on and we're going to restore to that okay now as you can see this is our registry backup now you can see here restart and shut down the system when it's finished that's what we're going to do and we're just going to restore our registry it's that simple now this can get you out of a big jam okay so we're just going to close this off and this can get you back up and running if you've got good backups of your registry now it does take a bit of time before it shuts down and restarts but it will do it just have to give it be a bit patient and there we go we're going to restart in now and there we are back at our desktop with our system restored so that's basically how you can restore your registry with tweaking.com windows repair tool it's a free tool to use and it's a great tool for backing up and restoring your registry now I know uh, you may be saying what happens if the PC doesn't boot and the registry is all corrupted well we'll be covering that in another video and I'm going to show you how you can restore your uh, registry from uh, a Windows CD and get into the command prompt and then we'll restore it from there okay using uh, tweaking.com windows repair tool okay so thanks again for watching guys i hope this video helps you out my name is brian from brightechcomputers.co.uk if you enjoy these videos then hit the like button guys it really does help me out and also hit the subscribe button if you want to keep up to date when i upload new videos so thanks again for watching guys and thanks for your video ideas and uh, i'll see you again in the next video bye for now